Hi everyone, welcome. I'm meteorologist Sam Ryan. Taking a look now at the month of May, since it's over with, uh, our temperatures have been slightly cooler than normal. Our precipitation slightly above normal by three tenths of an inch and snowfall by 1.3 inches. You remember that? <laughs> well, here's a look at some of the snow up in the mountains here in Jackson Hole. And uh, that snow is beginning to melt. Look at all that sunshine we saw on our Friday on our last day of May. Nice and pleasant at the base of the mountain here, getting ready for some mountain biking, it looks like. And uh, waiting for those uh, little patches of snow to finally clear. So we do have a shower activity kind of sliding a little farther to the east into the Dakotas. Here's a look, satellite and radar loop, big area across the central plains. Uh, but we do have slight, uh, small disturbances that will bring in threats for an isolated shower still throughout our day Saturday and Sunday and even into Monday and early next week. So active snow melt though, temperatures will be running above normal. So uh, mountain snow could rapidly melt. Watch the creeks and the streams if you're heading out at all. And then breezy at times with an isolated shower threat through the afternoon and evening with above normal temperatures and elevated fire weather risk, especially looking ahead. So it's a mainly dry forecast with the exception of that isolated storm threat. And we're expecting just a general thunderstorm chance on our Saturday off to the far east. We do have a marginal threat down across uh, near the Nebraska Panhandle and a slight risk in the yellow shaded area. General thunderstorm chance again for the day on Sunday. As we watch the forecast model and put this into motion, again, most of the day is just dry. We just get these pockets of moisture and isolated shower storm quickly moving through. And if you're in the higher elevation, uh, if you're, you, you know how quickly these things can develop, then just spring up on you. So just be aware of that. So it'll be around 43 degrees on our Saturday morning, 46 in Douglas and daytime highs. Look at the average 74. We're going to make it up to around 81, 78 in Douglas, 74 in Newcastle, 75 Rapid City and Riverton at 84 with that isolated storm threat. Winds only gusting to around 16 miles per hour. Not too bad, but we noticed the winds picking up some by Monday and Tuesday, as uh, the potential of a front nears the area on Tuesday, it could lower the temperatures, a slightly higher chance of some showers on Tuesday. So looking at 78 degrees out here for our Sunday, 80 in Douglas, 79 in Newcastle, Monday, low 80s, even mid 80s possible in Douglas. So very warm temperatures increasing that uh, mountain snow melt. So that's for our Monday, we'll be around 82, and then Tuesday, a frontal boundary nears, so Shaving a few degrees off the high, down to 74. We're right back in the low to mid 80s, though, Wednesday and Thursday with more sunshine to end the week.